Hey guys, what's going on? It's Alan here and today we're gonna check out something important whether you are a YouTuber that didn't record something or you're just interested in what you did wrong in your previous um, previous wingman match or you want to check someone you know, you know what I mean. The basic point of this video is to show you how to download the demo like you get in a competitive match uh, in Wingman, so you can watch it back, you know? The whole process is pretty simple, so it's gonna be very quick. What you need is go on your Chrome or whatever browser you have, uh, log into your Steam account, and uh, once you go on your profile, here you have on the right side, you have games, right? So you click here and um, you're gonna have Counter-Strike. So you go under personal game data and you click the first thing, you know, your profile. Then what you'll have to do is here you'll locate the wingman matches. You open that up and here you can see your latest matches, okay? And right there you you have download GO TV replay. You go ahead and click that. Uh, yeah, the Chrome gives that. It's it's like a it's it's it sees it like a thread, but still you you click keep. Um, and then what you're gonna have to do is you're gonna have to locate your Steam folder, which for me is under C, Program Files, x86, and we need Steam. We're gonna go under Steam Apps, Common, uh, Counter Strike Global, Global Offensives, CSGO. You're gonna open that with WinRAR. And as you can see, I have here one already. You're just going to drag that into here. Okay. After that, we're going to go into the game. Okay. So once you are in the game, you press shift and F2. This command will pop up and you go to load. And here you'll see it opens up. You can actually load file from anywhere. It's just easier because it opens up this as default. And then you choose the one you want. We, as you can see, we uploaded this one right now. This was from before. You hit open and voila, you have a match. You can switch from players. You can, if you um, deleted that command, you just go shift F2 and you can jump through rounds. You can jump through deaths and stuff like that. You can pause, you can replay and things like that. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching, hope this video was helpful, let me know if you need any help at all down below, and I will see you all in the next one. Bye bye.